super heavy topic but super important. I visited both the private and public sectors for breast doctors or rather they are called general surgeons. For public hospitals, you have to get a referral from the polyclinics. Why the pub- polyclinics cannot immediately diagnose you anything etc because they are under the family medicine major just like your family doctor. So after you get a referral, you will visit the hospital for the first time. They will examine you and then send you for a test, the ultrasound, etc. Which is probably another visit. Then after the ultrasound, you don't see a doctor immediately. It will be still another visit to conclude something. So that's a total of three visits. Yes. <laughs> I feel like the frustration by the time that you have an outcome, you have been too frustrated and say, okay, just take out whatever. I don't care what it is. Yes, dramas are a lie. They won't immediately ward you other than if you're like probably stage 4 or 5 kind of situation. For the earlier stages, I feel like if you wanted me to put it in the worst possible way, you are just another patient. So for private clinics, they would usually have a bedside ultrasound. According to SGH, they say this is not so accurate, which I was a little bit like, I don't know why SGH sometimes seem to make them sound like they are more superior than private clinics. <laughs> okay, never mind about that. Yes, it is very important for you to look for the right doctor, just like the right medicine. There's also fertility doctor for people trying to give birth, then OBGYN only. Yes, yes, yes. So do ask around, check around for like medical stuff. Actually, a lot of people might have a lot of experience and they can share with you. This is how sharing helps to like spread and gain knowledge. So I have put some pictures here and there which I'll have, which I have labeled and hopefully it's helpful. Invasive surgery would mean anything that cuts open your skin and not just a needle poking in.